What is meaning? Philosophy ponders this question without ever interrogating the meaning of is. The presumption of the static misunderstands the very nature of the world that renders meaning a product of connections balance. A body's meaning is uh, dependent upon other bodies and so much with a bike that doesn't have meaning until it connects with another machine, with a cyclist. It becomes a vehicle in a gallery, it becomes our work. A body is no different when it connects to a bicycle, becomes a cyclist, a sip to a cigarette, a smoker, and it impacts a point, takes out static conceptions of the subject because we prove that identity is constantly shaped and reshaped our, our interactions with the world and be point uh, to disprove the wideness of our conception of the subject. You need to approve that subject. Don't have emotions about worldly interactions now, too. Only affect can account for the indeterminacy of the ethical moment. Ethics comes about when previous structures of thought are appended by new situations with new actors. Traditional ways of uh, thinking define the terms of morality so as to justify themselves, causes us to be complicit in a flawed epistemology. This necessitates that obligations and action can only uh, be derived from, af uh, from affect brain. Traditional ethics what begins with determined situations and then searches for a world of like, way to action. The question is how, uh, how crisis can be ameliorated by your existing principles. The ethical and kind of principles no longer hold brother. The question is how situations must be recomposed in response. Mantra, uh, from the perspective of the event of uh, holds composed of all sorts of heterogeneous actors, not human uh, objects act all the time, modifying the uh, situation. But affective fields are not pure. Whiteness a priori constitutes the conditions on which subjects come to be and to navigate the world. Positioning blackness is always already non-subject and thus creating structuring orientations in which the potentiality of blackness is ontologically foreclosed. Yancey. A white orientation gives a sense of inner uh, knowledge, the right to ostracize those who don't naturally belong as a, 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 a black as a use or body mirror object that occupies space. Blackness uh, expresses a relation to the world in the form of I cannot whiteness has become structural orientation performance since we suppose the uh, not self in the form of others' existence. And the standard and rule of the ballot is to vote for the better, best, formally, methodologically engages in affective action, thinking, and oppression. My body is always already bound up in systems of whiteness, positioned uh, uh, position as specific identity categories and qual uh, qualities and parts. One, it takes out util a point. There's no objective way to measure pain and pleasure that's applicable for all subjects because it's an emotional response and B-point pain and pleasure both shape subjects that can be to avoid one and three but the other is incoherent and now two affect is key to material change because it's a question of how we understand other subjects feelings in accordance with their own uh, coalition building presumes that we can A-point and present another person B-point collect, uh, collectively or direct their actions towards a certain goal we advocate for the methodology of black rage not only as a form of engaging with debate, but also as a pure to things like the resolution. How uh, can you expect me to get up and talk about development assistance when niggas are still getting gunned down in the streets at home? The uh, violence enacted on its acts is a barrier to my accessing any pedagogical benefits of the resolution, which necessitates that the discussion of the aftrights to ignite happens first. And part two is the offense. Black rage is more than just me yelling at specific mechanisms by which to understand material relations and the relationship to the non-material we rework. Uh, whiteness is control over ash and tearing MLK away uh, from a peace-loving minister and embracing the fed-up threat emotional affirmation of rage the sla uh, from the slave song to protest Jordan 1. A black rage is a burning from the sounds of bullets leaving a, uh, 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 leaving a rifle ready to explode beats under the reverberation of sounds black rage is electric rage words upon the boundaries of psychological meaning rage is incredibly powerful because of the very emotion that one is not supposed to reside within black indignation is strictly uh, forbidden um, and rage is multiplicative different for different folks in different situations but one thing fucking straight that my, the denial of my ability to performatively engage in rage is a willed act of psychological violence against my body rage allows for the expression of the of pain of blackness which has been a, uh, which has been and is continually subjected uh, to uh, 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 subjected to violence from slavery to police brutality blackness is a death sentence a sentence I cannot be nullified by normal means I should be pissed and I uh, should get to express that Jordan too. Rage out to the individual rage to be a form of self-aware way of self-protection levels in cases. Stacey McDonald's CCC is a black rage of the ability to collectivize the struggle effectively in cool and struggles of the non beings, a high-level atrocities on mass scale. A rage for the gaps between different non beings, high allowing for an affect of feeling individuals, liberation being bonded up together, rage more well situated. A solidarity, black rage. A main researcher's plan is for the new world was, and the soul of the old was possible. A space of collectivity that defies forces of uh, separation and isolation. Now, net benefits. One is possibility. Our method opens up a space to use a diversity of tactics to resist oppression. The question is not on its own, but a possibility focusing not just on the outcome, but with the decision to act in the first place, joining three. The politics and possibilities large and liberal strategy enter the organization of society and become comfortable with possibility if you're focused on the decision to act with the intention that actually result in something. It requires a diversity of types within our complex world of what of relationality and two is survival strategy. Even if institutions are affected by Methodism, the best survival is first order because you can internally to move, engaging in other any other methods which is proven survival strategy via the CC McDonald case study to warrant a point physically that she used, which is a little method of survival killing her white terms attack with the pure scissors, people in psychological rage is a method to resist the psychological violence that institutions go after to the bodies of black folks now. Three is collective it's an the reason for a framework because it motivates other bodies to be active in the movement in the wake of uh, the CC attack. The queer community at large was motivated to support a trans black one of the things like this. Support CC uh, committee in black and four is critical education. Our method poses a question of orientation towards the life violence and oppression. It's not just about loss of three minutes of three rounds. This also always any other education will be due to the oppression as well. Uh, prevents access from education to in the first place. Orientation to do it must be a starting point and. 
We control the internal length of the immune topicality. My body, my blackness is not one in this space or other educational spaces. White supremacy operates on the exclusion of blackness as dangerous and reproduces this exclusion in the context of the debate space absent analysis in the way in which black bodies are excluded or doomed to recreate these oppressive systems. Schneider. Black students are destructive of civil society. There is something organic in black positional oil that makes it essential to the destruction of civil society. White supremacy, or, or uh, yeah, white supremacy, or, sorry. Uh, blackness has to be contained to manage in order to protect white supremacy. White supremacy needs to be protected on social relations of power in order to maintain its subjective advantage when blackness becomes identified as anti ethical notions of work. White supremacy. Uh, white supremacy is able to unleash history upon the black body. The uh, self asserts concept of these from Russia's degrading such a white supremacy was a total reproduction. The veil of right privileges to move the logical white supremacy. The firm's American nationalism is fully revealed within public education as a company to analyze the uh, root cause of the inequality and equity and impacts. One, it takes out your theory. Your uh, theory is weaponized as a form of excluding blackness that's intrinsically dangerous, which is an obvious form of anti black violence. And two, independently affirms in our framing science is the way, uh, we, the way uh, we disrupt social modes, reproduction through self assertion and self love. Our method of black rage is self assertion in a way that explicitly makes whiteness uncomfortable and under view. One of is starting when it sends you the one AOS, one of the one of the offensive B, one of the two of the offensive the only speech where you can. It's that long on any one issue, you must weigh any theoretically justified argument against this and uh, skip to four. Don't hold us accountable for any non disclosed and negative purposes we couldn't uh, prepare for there. Or Expect their theoretical um, expectations. Yeah. What's black rage? Black rage is an affective response to oppression. It's an affective response to oppression. Okay, what's a performance? Uh, I mean, the one I see was a performance. Okay. Um, how? Yeah, like what is a performance? Sure, it is the it's like a um, method of engaging in spaces like debate. It's a uh, via of things like, so is that is every like reading of an AC a performance? I wouldn't say that every reading of an AC is a performance. I won't speak to larger macro examples of or, or like a, a set structure of what a performance can be. I would say that it uh, it stems from like an affective relationship okay, that so a debater has with the debate community. I say that I'm engaging in a performance. I, am I engaging in a performance? Um, sure, if you justify it. Okay. It's not just like yeah, I perform. How do you justify like, it? Sure, I think there are many justifications for a performance. Uh, one, we would say that our refusal to uh, from the topic in the way that like most people think we're supposed to from the topic is our uh, or is my example of rage within the debate community itself. I'm refusing to follow the rules or uh, or the or this like notion that I must affirm the topic that has previously been like uh, set forth by the community. Okay. I would say that the uh, song. What does it mean written, to affirm the topic? Um, I don't know and I don't care. Okay, why is affirming the topic bad then? If like we don't even know what affirming the topic means, then why is it bad? We know that it, um, sure. We know that it's bad to force debaters to defend things like the state when there is a relationship between that debater okay. because of some part of their identity and the state or in okay. the system that could hear the state. Does the state necessitate defending everything the state has ever done? Um, yes. 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 Why? If you're like this uh, agency is good and should take an action, okay. the, this where defending that the state takes an action, why does that implicitly say that the state is good? Sure, because if you if the state isn't good, then that's the state shouldn't take that action. Okay, state, could a bad person take an action? Sure, but okay. why would that? Or, but like, sure. So why does the state taking an act? Why does defending that the state should take an action mean that uh, you're defending that the state is good? Um, well, even, okay, so even if you won that, we would still say that the affirmative functions as a prerequisite for black debaters specifically okay, to sure. engage in defending the state. Sure, we may, we have a lot of evidence about the way that black uh, or the way that black debaters are excluded uh, yeah, from so the debate. Yeah, so you're to say like black rage can help like uh, sort of combat things like racism or make uh, or like help people sort of process things like that. Why does that mean as a prerequisite to engaging with the topic? Sure, because if there are other things that affect Solon's ability to engage in educational spaces like debate, then the way that you want me to engage in the topic is structurally inaccessible to me. The and way so that I want you to engage, what way do I want you to engage in the topic? Apparently, you want me to defend that the state takes an action. Okay. Um, that's fine. I'll send it out. Non-TFs are very fun. They are. I'm ready for this uh, non-generic way of dealing with the non-TF. A non-generic way of responding to a non-TF. It's definitely not this It hasn't come in yet. Yeah. Uh, I've sent it, so let me know how you get it. What was the song? Um, it's called Fuck You by Ja Rule. By who? Ja Rule. Um, like a 90s rapper, which may be early 2000s. Our author, oh, 
and make them up. Ah, oh, here it is. Okay. Is everyone ready? No, we haven't opened it yet. I mean, okay. it's going to be there. Is it just going to be the too often the case, or are you going to do any like responding to the F? Or, or responding to the underview on the, uh, the It's going to be case underview. Okay. Uh, so.
resources to access things like uh, books or articles with paywalls. Um, to to it uh, incentivize it, it like allows us debaters to know more specific arguments that are being made. Like obviously, like every article makes a multitude of arguments. But if you allow, if you full text disclose what part of the so argument, so why does first three and um, last three not solve? Uh, it doesn't solve you, evidence ethics. It like certainly not? wouldn't solve uh, because, because can I can't ensure that the card has been cut and tagged accurately. So your your full text disclosure does not actually show what you've cut. It just shows a block of text. Exactly. How so can I, I can read the block of text. I can read that block of text and see what it says so for full text disclosure. So if then, I disclose sites, why can you then not go to where I've cited stuff? And uh, look and sure, because and things that. like paywalls make it impossible uh, for schools with less resources to access. Okay, uh, then why can't you like send someone a message and be like, hey, this card in your app has a paywall. Okay, Can you send sure. Me, why would you just disclose it full text? Like, I'm, well, I'm asking you why to, for you to justify why full text is uniquely necessary. Like some people you don't haven't have proven Facebook. that it is necessary. I, okay, I so if they don't have Facebook, why can't they email me? My email's on the wiki. So like, what is it about full text that is like you need okay. that you uh, cannot sure. get in any other form of disclosure that I have failed to provide to this? Uh, sure, it provides access. Uh, also, like I asked you to disclose if you would disclose your case to me, and you said no. I have no. screenshots. Oh, really? I have screenshots as well. Uh, so you. <laughs> You said you I would disclose me. advocacy text and sites, and I said full text. Yes, you asked me if I would disclose full text. I said we don't believe in reducing performances down to text, sure. but I you will send you sites and an advocacy it. statement. Why are sites not just as good as full text? I have just explained no, you that debaters with, debaters <laughs> with access to less resources cannot access like these sites that have certain like paywalls. Okay, so then also, why can't those debaters send an email to the debaters, or, or, or to the person whose wiki it is, and be like, can you send me this card from your app? I mean, full text disclosure would still be better. I don't. Why? It's, it's that's still fundamentally full text disclosure. It, what? Okay, but it, okay, sure. Um, let's talk about the terms that you read on the case. Walk me through these terms. Okay. Uh, so the first, the Delgado card explains how uh, your form of politics of just like raging is privilege and it doesn't work to improve people's day-to-day -day lives like it might make people feel better in the moment but it actually uh, it sort of detracts from things that are at like from material conditions that are actually going on and like how we can solve those uh, in order to like uh, provide okay. sort of short relief but uh, what is the what is the warrant for this I just talked about so CC McDonald if she had not engaged in rage would be dead today 
She yes. is. Uh, we are talking about de- uh, rage and things like debate, not like not like raging against like. But why is, but why does that mean that my method as a whole is bad? Yeah. So uh, that that's like first of all, that's in the Delgado card. Uh, it's, <laughs> your method as a whole is bad because it like just detracts from like material change. I'm not sure. Like, okay. It's not Whatever. the same in Start CC from. Delgado. You're not uh, in CC. You're not uh, sure, like, that's raging fine. against me using you. Did you read a TVA? Uh, yeah. Cool. It's in the top. Uh, it uh, doesn't matter. Disclosure T, I believe. Uh, I'm actually oh, let me run prep for like one second. Stop prep. Okay, cool. New off um, AF T disclosure. The AF in what order? Um, the order that I give it in the speech, I don't know yet. Okay. Um, probably it'll be like framing. Then the, the the prep thing, the, the prep out, um, and then, yeah. So framing, prep out, I'll sign post. So uh, I'm saving the doc now. Oh, okay. <laughs> Washington, are you near Seattle? Uh, yeah, the Seattle area. I'm like 30 minutes north of Seattle. Oh. Yeah. Like one of those places that I want to visit. You should. It's fun. It's a party. Oh, oh fuck. Same. Yeah, that Portland hmm? in Vancouver. Those three. Yeah. I feel. Is everybody ready? Yeah. yeah. Um, just to remind everyone, there's going to be a new office, so you might want a new sheet. Yes. Okay, cool. The plot does stick in. Um, 
actual round. Huh? An actual round. <laughs> Yikes. And okay. Holy Cross is just so trash. <laughs> <laughs> There's one good debater in the entire fucking floor and I judged him once. <laughs> Rip. Oh, um, okay. So, is new off. New off case. Um, yeah, new off case topicality disclosure. And the new off relates to disclosure, so. Okay. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> hey. You good? Yeah. Okay. New off. A is the interpretation of black debaters must be able to engage if you achieve to be as a violation of your call for disclosures that a measure to render us visible to form of white surveillance to clarify you may not read disclosure three now see a vote half a one American surveillance news from slavery the original list of human cargo plantation inventories and a diaries were used by masters to govern slave disciplinary power operating through the compulsory visibility of targets and the one it sees are uh, sorry the uh, one it sees demand for disclosures the particular example of how these practices have evolved and split over into the domain space brown the history of surveillance in American traces of slavery accounts included this slave vessel manifest list of human cargo plantation inventories diaries which contain Observations about plantation life and instructions for governing slaves in the detailed catalog, you know, so that puts a mechanism of disciplinary power where disciplinary power is exercised to its invisibility while imposing a compulsory visibility on its target disciplinary power operated as a racialized surveillance. Such a racialized surveillance was dependent on the plantation security system that relied on the slave rituals and when it poses a compulsory visibility of racial that subject can be, uh, can be seen through uh, in the circulation of advertisements and wanted or wanted papers to run race slaves. These sex become part of uh, apparatus of surveillance and surveillance and technology of the future to see advertising may be already here visible racial subject eligible uh, that's out of place. The one admitted for the future of slavery is an information technology demonstrates that now, uh, that then as now, race was a social country that required constant placing and oversight on impact. A point. If we went our descriptive claim about disclosure vis a vis plantation mentality, you have to vote for it to reject the, uh, their plantation acts of violence, which is a form of psychological violence against black debaters. Now, B, if there's an independent safety voter here, black debaters are treated in a way that is remnants of slavery times they are forced to experience psychological trauma and every round swings and then impact filter to any of their education. Uh, education or fairness claims it's a question of potential access to those education or uh, fairness now. Uh, go to the case first. Extend the role of the after the release suppression, a point from the entirety of the theory debate uh, because it functions on a higher, a higher layer of viewpoint. Shutter says that theory is organized as a way to exclude black folks in debate, which is an independent reason to drop before because it reproduces exclusionary norms. Now, uh, theory, uh, theory functions in a way to exclude black performances. Uh, I, I never quite been good enough to fit in, 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 this, in this space of debate. Also, uh, you say that this is going to be a double turn because I read uh, the, uh, the article under you, but we uh, speak specifically to the affective relationship of, uh, of, uh, of, uh, of white debaters that uh, are using theory to exclude black performance. Now, extend John and Smith action is always derived from affective relationships, refusing to challenge. Uh, or sorry, this is the brand card. Re uh, refusing to challenge dominant mindsets that require certain bodies to fill in certain ways is how whiteness coheres itself spaces, but begin to accommodate dominant bodies that exist within them. This creates psychological violence and disincentivizes social from engaging and movements to create changes in the absence of black rage, which changes the source of the race just another end of the institution, accommodating bodies now too weak from the resolution to a method of black rage. Uh, a point of survival is the first priority within an institution's only one I see the survival strategy. You've also conceded explicit impact way that says so survival is the first priority under our rule of value, which means if we uh, win even an iota of offense on our rule of value, you have to go for us because they have conceded our survival strategy and that benefit. Uh, and B point extends side of the second impact independently affirms in our framing. They've conceded that we are a form of self assertion that is able to disrupt uh, uh, the modes of the, the ways in which white supremacy, uh, white supremacy reproduces itself now on theory. Uh, one, the rule of the comes for theory. A point it determines what we should read and, uh, and debate what's constraining black like theory. And B point it controls the strongest internal link to inclusion and accessibility is a multiplier. Your impacts don't matter if they're only applied to a privileged elite. And C point it determines what it means to be the better debater, which means it contextualizes what fairness is. Now let's talk about the app dump. Uh, uh, first off, your Delgado evidence. This is empirically, uh, this is empirically denied. A point is the CC McDonald evidence. CC used a uh, rage as a form to literally survive. If, if rage was super counterproductive, then uh, if rage was about uh, if, uh, uh, rage is what allowed CC to continue to live now. Uh, to, uh, uh, off your. Um, or off the off your uh, evidence that says we produce violence, uh, oh, we say that this is the entire point of rage. A point is that this is just going to be solvency for us. We say that the uh, the whiteness is only responded uh, has only been responsive to violence, and this is empirically proven. Well, the Black Panthers decided to uh, follow police officers around to make sure that they weren't uh, brutalizing people. There is a decrease in police, police brutality, which means that we do have solvency. That's also independently takes out Gutman now on T first. Uh, the counter uh, the, uh, the counter interpretation is their interpretation unless we disclose that uh, disclosure souls are offense. You could have checked our sites, which means there's. Uh, you should have checked your sites and you knew what we were reading. You then have a, a full seven minute prep out to my app. This is a, uh, also off switch that debate. A point where it doesn't solve uh, the offense. Doing it on both sides means you do it twice as much on TV. There's no TVA because the government can't act on rage. You haven't explained how rage is a policy that can be enacted. Yeah, I didn't read a lot of stuff on the doc on T, but it was just the three and four point. Uh, the one point I didn't read. 
and the two point for switch side bid. Uh, the yeah. one point for which one? Um, the one point for TBA. You read uh, three and four. I have four minutes. Where was the bathroom? Maybe one, two. Okay. Like, like right there. Right there. I thought Is you like your raw sex yeah, during my problem. Is there water fountain there too? <laughs> You're good. Hold on, give me a second. T, new off, F. I could throw away the disclosure flip. You can. You said, no, no, no disclosure? Are you? you, you yeah, you can throw away. Trash is really far away. Oh. Uh, <laughs> I, I don't know what this is. The trash. Oh, yeah, you can throw it to Ethan. It's trash. <laughs> okay. Is everyone ready? Mm -hmm. Yeah, let's do it. To pay this game in modest tradition or necessary to respond to the competitive nature of the activity, predictable limits are keep maintaining equitable dialogue and our worth potential substance of trade, all slums, futility, facility, discretion, so the most sense of the ability to engage engagement is key to what argument testing and condensation, condensation of ideas is necessary to prove holes in each other's arguments and determine the correct solution which proves that in order to evaluate the truth claims of the athlete, first have to be tested and on an ability to engage in this debate means that you can't evaluate any other cross applications from the AK case stands or cheap because their validity is artificially inflated. You can't extend their own role without they haven't uh, the, you, you can see that you can't evaluate the truth claims of the, of the one AC uh, of the one ACs and so forth they haven't been, we, we are not able to test. Our Oregon dice that practice of debate, which, which, which link turns all of your arguments are interpreted in during the discussion that the UNSC produces is productive and effective at deconstructing the state procedural fairness, mitigating the impacts of substantive unfairness and infinite amount of absence. The only tools that will be able to see a competitive debate are the ones with the most resources and also discourages participation in the activities of all the educational benefits from the app that turns you all of your off. No one's going to be benefiting from your own ability if they're going to be just to begin with. You see, you use sufficiency for me when evaluating the topical version of the app debate. Our TPA solves most of the education of the app. Any solving the app is proven the app is contestable and controversial position rating at the uh. You can you can extend the topical version of the app here. Yes, it still incorporates the same in some way, but which side to debate debate solve? Uh, but which side to debate solve? You can read your app on the net. You can be complete criticism of the state. You can be complete criticism of the, of the, of the state on the net. But finding a stable thesis point, it, uh, but it, depending on stable thesis point, is key to research on the line by line. Our disclosure show condition was what uh, condition was what disclosure is. You, you don't need your own kind of interpretation. You, do, you, you, should, you should you should default, you should default net. You should default net on But you also uh, you also can you, uh, you also can see that we can tell that the topical version of the app can still uh, can still introduce it. Can still introduce a perspective. Uh, it's perspective to reach defending these states, defending these states doesn't mean that you are defending these states. Could the uh, uh, cross is also pretty damning on this issue about it. You can you can say that a bad person can still uh, uh, you can say that a bad person should still take an action to become a better person. That doesn't mean that you're saying that a bad person is a uh, is a good person. Is a good person. You literally uh, you you agree to this and cross this proof that defending the state doesn't mean that you uh, just it doesn't mean that you're defending the state is good. But also uh, you can see that uh, you can see that reading this position on the next solves all of your solves all of your offense and, and makes sort of a better model of debate. You see, nobody's going to stay in debate if you could just if there's no place for the night in debate. If you were if you're making uh, if you're making claims that are uh, uh, virtually unimpeachable like race. Racism is bad. Obviously, uh, you're not either forcing me to a defense that puts you that puts you in a double. It's forcing me to a defense. Depends something that is morally reprehensible. Uh, that is morally uh, repugnant. Or, or B or B. There is no place for the negative. The negative is just going to uh, or can see the round because there is no place for the negative. The negative is the people are just going to drop out of debate. We're not going to be having these discussions in the first. We're not going to be having these discussions in the first place. This means that even if there are some solvency deficits.
to be a to be a to be a TBA where you can't fully have the exact same perspective. You get exact same perspective. You should still negate on this debate because uh, reading your position on the next hole, you also can see that you could just read. Uh, you you could read your case. You could read uh, your case as a framework and then read it uh, and then read and then read uh, historical examples of why the weeks of what all these have used have used all in the past and why they should uh, do it differently to deconstruct uh, to deconstruct the way that they uh, treat the, 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 way, the way that they treat the black body. This is all the the majority of your often still introduces the very similar perspective, not the exact same perspective into uh, the exact same perspective into the round. Uh, you, and you're on your northern norms answers insufficient. We're talking about the norms for debate for the debate community, not the norms for the individual round because the other already been the right. Uh, the, the, if you lose if you lose the space, that is you might not uh, you might just read this on the neg and no one read it and, and no one read this on the ads, which means uh, the, 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 it's not about the norms for this round, it's about the norms you set for the community and we uh, and, and there, there's no rule of battle before here. You, you've conceded that you can't evaluate. You've conceded the, uh, that, that you can't, that we can't, that because there's no place for the night in the space, because there's no so because you don't allow for things like switch that debate. That means we can't evaluate the true claims of the one I see, which means that you can't extend your rule of battle. You can't extend anything out of the app because you've not answered the fact that uh, we cannot test the true claims of the one I see, which means your rule of battle does not come before theory. But you've also conceded several reasons that you are, do not need your rule of battle. I need new off. There's no warrant, and the only, the only card that you read about why surveillance is bad, there's no warrant. It just talks about how surveillance true from slavery. It doesn't talk about how this specifically applies to theory, but also you should, you, you read no warrant. For drop the debate for drop the debate on this. Uh, you should you should just drop the organized more proportional abuse and allows us to get back to the substance of debate about, about things like race and if you uh, uh, if you force me to go if, if you if you draw me on this is forcing me to go all in on a position that uh, is racist and uh, on a position that is racist. Um, uh, but there's also no war for why this cause this so there's no war for why this causes psychic violence. This was an answer to the uh, this was an, an the answer to the underview which you can see there's no war in any of card why why uh, it causes uh, why we are causing psychological violence. You shouldn't vote on this argument. It doesn't cause psychological violence. We are just trying to create better debates. Uh, we are also we are just trying to create better debates. Also, possession of all these standards on disclosure uh, means that it is better for uh, for people with uh, for debaters uh, with less resources and allows us to better substantively engage, uh, which turns all of your shell. But we're not going for it. On the AF. Um, the, the only evidence of your going for the only evidence of your going for this is that Delta Obama, you do not even you know, do not do nearly enough work uh, and you, nearly enough work responding to this. You just say that it is empirically not because uh, uh, because of, because of the case where uh, because of the case where Rachel works in the real world. This is specific to uh, yeah, all of our evidence is specific to instances of debate. Rachel isn't good in debate. Doesn't teach us how to. Uh, Rachel isn't good in debate. And so far as like I am not I am not being actively abusive right now. And so far as I, and even if uh, and so far as I'm not being and debate, I'm being actively abusive before you read the one I see. This is not uh, this is not helping you. This is not a survival strategy. And this is not a survival strategy in debate. It is a policy. The privilege it doesn't teach you how to actually combat these norms. It doesn't combat these norms in the real world. It just helps us feel better in the short term. You can read your attitude around this is pretty much about uh, how to help people deal with racism, but we need to not learn how to deal with racism and process racism. We need to learn how to change racism. And, uh, and, you, and you ignore this, this ignores the material conditions that people face. Maybe we're just good in the real world, but it's specifically bad in the debate space. I and mean, you don't meet your rule of value. Also, you cannot apply your rule of value. You can see the entirety of our, you can see the entirety of our team framework show, which talks about like, uh, the fact that you don't offer to switch that debate means we can't contest the truth claims. It means we can't contest the true claims of the app, means that you can't cross by the rule of valid because we don't know if the rule of valid is, uh, is necessarily true but also it also means that theory, uh, the theory, the entire team from Charles means that theory comes before the rule of valid because uh, reading this case on the uh, reading this case on the neg would solve the rule of valid our interp solves the rule of valid you could just read this on the neck uh the interp comes first proving you can also cross by all the no rbis uh which also means that you can't vote on the independent voting issues but also uh you cross by the no rbis that uh proving that you are fair or educational is not a reason that you should uh win the debate uh and you yeah uh vote on the t cool. starting prep now <coughs> Framing issues. The framing issues will be just like in relation to um, the framing issues will be in relation to uh, sorry, like 
theory of topicality debate, and then it's going to be AFT. Does that make sense? Mm -hmm. Okay, cool. Cool. Um, is everybody ready? Accepting interpretation is why does must be able to engage in fugitivity now. You're, you make you make four responses to this one. Your first response, you say that we have no warrant, but the warrant is that you force us to become visible, and you say that failure to become visible will be that hyper visualized racial subject, which is what Brown talks about, results in us being punished. This is evidence by you, uh, the fact that you read and disclose yourself, and you said the impact of this is that we should be dropped for a failure uh, for a failure to render ourselves visible to you. Uh, that, that is where the psychological premise comes from now. Your second and third argument, I'm going to group you, say that uh, you see that we don't give a warrant for a drop. Uh, drop the debate, which means it should be dropped the argument, but that is functionally not true. We uh, specifically have a safety vote, which indicates that, 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 that it's going to be it's an independent voting issue, and because if black debaters are treated uh, are treated, uh, treated with like plantation esque violence, that uh, it should be a reason that the judge should intervene against the uh, against the uh, against the offending debater. Now uh, you have also conceded that this safety voter comes on a higher layer than any of your education or fairness impacts because it controls the internal link to education and fairness, which means that if there is any question on the theory debate, you're going to have to be airing affirmative one of this specific show. Now, you have all, your, your last response was just you repeating that you don't cause psychological violence, but there are brown evidence is an empirical or is an example, it's a specific example of how you, your practices do cause psychological violence. Now, let's go to the after me. Now, first as an overview issue, you only have two offensive claims coming out of the, the, the entirety of your framework shell, and they are TVA and switch side debate. Now, off your TVA, you have completely conceded our response, which was that the government cannot act on rage. This uh, independently takes out most of their offense on T, on T because it means that the, this is not something that the government uh, can act on, which means that sure, even if the, uh, which means that sure, even if all your other responses are true, at uh, the point where you have conceded it is not compatible with the government, there is no uh, topical version of the app. It is not a question about a solvency deficit, but rather a TVA exists in the first place. Now, off your switch side debate claim, you uh, do not respond to the argument that doing it on both sides means we do it twice as much. You just repeat that uh, we could do it on the negative, but we say, uh, sure, we can do it on the negative, but we should also be doing it on the affirmative because now we introduce a discussion to made twice as much. These go, uh, cold considered. These uh, take out the entirety of the t shell specifically in relation to the app and the way uh, and, uh, and whether or not we can extend our rules about it now. On the app, I'm first extend the, uh, extend the rule about it to affectively resist oppression. Now, a major uh, framing issue under this is that you've conceded once again the explicit way that says that survival strategy uh, functions as the highest layer under our rule of the ballot, which means if we win even a iota of offense on, on as to why we are against survival strategy uh, for ourselves or for other black folk, then it is enough for the judge to vote from them. Now, first extend the second impact under uh, Schneider, which implicates that our form of self-assertion, sure, even if it is self-serving, it is still a survival strategy. You have not refuted this. It means that that's enough for you to vote up now. Extend the uh, physical uh, the physical warrant under the C.C. McDonald case study. It says that C.C. literally used Black Rage to uh, survive. Without it, she would have been dead. Now, uh, you only go for the Delgado evidence, but you don't respond to our argument about how this does affect material uh, lives of people. So talking about it in debate can have a, a spillover into the material lives of people. Now, off T, I already answered when I answered the two offensive claims they have. It, uh, it, it may look conceited, but it's not. <laughs> so. <laughs> right. So uh, I vote F, and here is exactly why. Okay. So there's a lot of claims that you could have made that could have made this debate go very easy for you. Okay. The, main, the two main voters to go for is TVA and switch side debate, right? Okay, first of all, I, I, I don't understand why doing it in the neg doesn't mean that you can't do it on the app. Like, why does, why does he have to always only do it on the neg? Uh, and like that solves. Yes, everyone has read this argument against everyone, right? That reads a non TL. Right. But there's no specific reason as to why, why he can't read it both times if he really wants to spread his message, right? That's true. TVA. Yes, it was a very small argument. It was very he, it was literally just a sentence that he blurbed out, right? Saying like, yo, government doesn't understand what black rage is, so you can't read a TVA. And but it was conceded. And you do all this work on like but the examples that you give are legit. I understand. Like you're like, oh you could read like uh, you could read your Athens framework and then read something like a like a description of a certain country where there's uh, rage is involved, like made something happen or something like that. Which is completely true. But if he says one the government doesn't understand just then there's no solvency to reading that app, which means you can't read it. But even past that, uh, 
this TV, the, all the TVA evidence, you, like all the TVA claims they make, are like about like colonialism and stuff like that. You should have made some like specific like version off of like Black Rage or something like that. Because you're like, I guess, because the one in the T shell is like about colonialism. Just make make it specific to the app. But other than that, let's go on this uh, this new off that he reads. Mm -hmm. Okay, so a couple of claims that you should be making. The new off is basically like black people or blackness should. Be, like able to like hide itself because we will get fucked over otherwise, right? So you should be saying stuff like, yes, there's this evidence is I have to admit is kind of outside of the debate sphere, right? Like let's all be honest, right? Yeah. So you should be making claims such as like, yo, sure, like maybe it's like black fugitivity is good, but in debate, if black fugitivity means like people are cheating and stuff like that, that's really fucked up for the activity. And then make a bunch of claims as to why cheating in debate is actually bad for blackness, or a cheating in debate is actually good for whiteness. And all of those are just turns to this, this case, right? Uh, the, 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 tea, the shell that he reads. This black safety voter here, um, psychological trauma, uh, yeah, that was kind of conceded, but I don't think it's like an independent voter per se. I think it just means that this matters more if any offense of the other shells matters, right? That's all it is. Okay. I, if it is an independent voter, I don't understand why. Okay. Um, Okay, where uh, other places? Um, okay, so what you should be going for on the T debate. So what I've noticed is when you go for T debate, you need to be contextualizing everything to make it better for the app. But you need to have this caveat that's just like, but this would only all be working if we did for the like if we did the T shell first, right? So you need to be like the entire T shell should not be stuff like. Yo, this is better for debate, or yo, debate is game, something like that, right? Saying that kind of stuff just makes him more mad, and then, it, like, it just kind of like it could reinforce. He could just be like, "That's a link," and stuff like that. You should be saying stuff like, "Black people have it bad in debate." Yes, I agree, but they're gonna have it worse if we don't confirm to a topic, or they're gonna have it worse if this happens, or they're gonna have it worse if that happens, right? It should be all about saying why the app is good. Yes, you're right. You can't say racism is bad as that is an answer to the app. We need to say why the app perpetuates racism more or why you're better for like getting rid of racism, right? And yes, like there's a lot of turns against rage and you should be going for those turns a little bit more. You only went for one piece, you should have gone for all three, right? So, um, also, uh, yeah, and also saying stuff like, the, you may you go for this big claim that's like, yo, maybe in the real world rage is good but it's not good for debate. That doesn't make sense to me. Right? Because you need to be touching more about why like rage and debate is bad. Because if anything, anything good in debate is probably good for the real world, right? Or anything good in the real world is probably good for debate, right? Uh, yeah. And also the dis disclosure shell. All right, I was kind of torn on this one just because I do think you should be disclosing tags. Oh. Because <laughs> see, that's the entire point, right? Like yeah. the tag and then the offense and the entire point, the, the tag and the card and the entire point of disclosure is to check. Oh, does the card agree with the tag or is he like? Uh, or like, are they like not just making outlandish claims, right? The shell should have been, you should have tags, not that you have to disclose full text, because I don't think you have to disclose full text. I think three words on both sides is fine. Tag, the shell should have been, you, you should have a tag. I think disclosing analytics, I'm not really sure where my stance is on that, but tag, disclosing tags is legit. And the disclosure shell must have been much, it should have been much, much shorter, right? And then this T shell also needs to, I don't think this T shell is really that, like, you have so many claims in this T-shell that's all about inclusion and all that shit, and you didn't touch upon any of that in the 2 r Right, debatability, you should've just gone hard for debatability, because like, the entire point of that standard is the answer to critiques, right? That's the entire point, that's the entire point why you put that standard in, it's just the answer to KFs, right? Uh, and you didn't hit it, it's like exactly what he did in the last round. The entire app is a preempt to the critique, and then it doesn't go for any of the preempts. The entire, the, that entire standard with the card was in preempt to the app. And you didn't, I mean, it wasn't really a preempt at that point. It's more like an answer. But, like, you didn't go for it. So, you go for two, top TVA and stuff like that is correct, but you just didn't do enough examples. And, yeah, your, your claim about how he doesn't get access to the roll ballot because we can't contest the truth claims of the app, that makes sense. And I think that is true. But you need to be winning offense of the T shell for that to be true. Okay. Uh, so, yeah, I don't, so is that. True, like yeah. If you won the t, if you were winning any offense of the t shell, that you would get access to the argument. Okay, I, is that not offense under the t shell? But you we weren't winning the t shell. The truth the you, we can't. But if he proves that he's good enough, he's, he's better for debate than topicality is, then, yes. 
right? And you don't need to be, you don't need to contest the truth claims of the app, right? You can just do all the things that I said. Concede that the app is good, and then just say why you do it better. That's the best way to hit beat chaos. You can have rage turns and stuff like that. Yes, you should read rage turns, but the entire point of the one in C should be like, yo, you're right. Black people will have it worse in debate than white people, but here's why the T, like at the top, like here's why T is better. That's all it should be. You should be going all for exclusion claims and stuff like that. Not debate is a game. Debate is probably a game under some interests, yes, but like the entire point of T against it, not TF, like this one, especially one where he goes hard for that kind of stuff, should just be like, yo, I agree, but here's why you're a little wrong. Okay? Yeah. That's really Any questions? Mm -hmm. What do you think about just like one AR strat and two AR I think class? Two AR was better. I think the one AR was actually pretty bad. Yeah, well, one well, it wasn't bad, but I'm no, it was bad. Necessarily it was fun. good. You you should have jumped on the. He conceded the entire T shell. He did. He read his one off, and then he like said like, no, TBA doesn't exist, and that was it. Right? His both of his answers that took out the rest of the T shell were literally just one word responses. That like he just said randomly because he was running out of time. So the, the two on R would have had it so easy if you had just beat the beat the new off, just be like, this doesn't really apply to debate here, 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 here's why. Like give like three reasons. And then just go for like the bill of you need to go for the standards in the shell. You did do like a big overview, but that was like five minutes. And like like that's fine, but you only went for two arguments in that five minutes. So like it was it was tough. But um I think it was a good round. I think it's probably one of the best ones I've ever done. <laughs> Just, like, oh, do you mind disclosing speaks? Wow. Yeah, 30, 20, 89, 3. Lit. Thanks.